In continuing coverage, we have a follow-up on a deadly crash last night that killed a 16-year-old. Was the driver drunk? That driver has been identified as 54-year-old Albert Fimbrez. He's been charged with murder, felony DUI, and violating probation. The crash happened near Valentine and Shields around 6 o'clock last night. 16-year-old Devon McCoy was walking with a friend when he was hit. CBS 47's Dennis Valera spoke with his family. Yeah, Catherine, it is set to start within the half hour. Now, Davon's mom, she describes him as her hero, saying he cared about everybody he met, took school seriously, and he also had big dreams ahead of him. He's also he was just really a really cool, funny, just he was just an average 16 year old. An average 16 year old with a smile ear to ear. Davon McCoy's mother, Terry, describes him as the kind of guy who'd give his shirt off his back. It, it, it didn't matter who you were. If, if you came in contact with Davon, like, you couldn't help but pick up his energy or his vibe. Like, he was really a cool kid. But as quick as he was to give his shirt, he was ready with a joke. <laughs> he called Luke old knees. So he raced them one day up the street and he was just like, Luke, you got old knees. McCoy and her seven other children are still wrapping their heads around what happened to Davon. Walking with a friend on Valentine Avenue, he got hit by a car driven by Albert Frimbres. Police say his blood alcohol level was below the legal limit, but he had three prior DUI convictions on his record. He also had a suspended license. He is on DUI probation, uh, court probation, and he shouldn't have any alcohol in his system, period. Devon, a sophomore at Central High East, had straight A's, according to his mother. She says he had big dreams to care for his family. He told me he was going to be an NFL <laughs> That's all he kept telling me, I'm, Mom. I'm, I'm a teenager, big dreams. I'm going to take care of you, Mom. I'm going to be an NFL player. <laughs> and I'm going to be something. I'm going to make something of myself. <laughs> and that was Dennis Valera reporting new at 5.